Hi guys, welcome to Israel's channel. I'm super super excited to bring you guys to this wonderful boom and crash strategy. The strategy is very very effective and the boom and crash strategy you can use to catch spike and auto scalping. So uh, without waiting much of a time, I will be quickly close all these trade now because I'm already running to a five hundred dollar profit and then I think I'm good with it. I'm okay with the profit. You can see that I took a sale and I buy on boom one thousand. And crash and crash for the so I'll be closing all trades now. I'll close all trades now so that we can begin to we can begin our like training uh video for today. So uh, okay, so now I'm good now. So uh now before I dive into this uh this content, before I dive into this today's video, I want you guys to know that we offer account management. You can contact this number you are seeing at the screen then we are going we are going to offer you an account management so uh and then if you want to join our telegram channel you can quickly join our telegram channel for free signals so you can join our telegram channel for free signals the link is going to be in the description below and also if you want uh, account management you can contact the number you are seeing at the screen that number you are seeing at the screen so then we are going to do an account management for you so if you are new to my channel don't forget to do me a favor by subscribe like and turn on your post notification your time on strategy and you guys will be aware so guys my voice is from uh is my low today so just manage it like that so uh without which more of our, of our time let's quickly let me quickly show you guys the setup for this strategy and now you guys can make use of this strategy where the battery strategy and i figure that this strategy is very very effective so i'll be using the both the crash for this and for this uh for this video because that's the trade i took with this uh strategy so we have we have uh indicate we are we are going to indicate in our main chart and we have other indicator in indicator in the one so now uh pay for the little everything up there we are going to start from from scratch so now you can see that i have a clear chart now i have a clear chart so and the first thing you are going to do is just go to this icon you are seeing at the stop so this is that icon you are seeing at the stop then click on this icon right here then as you're moving average so the moving average the uh parameters you, these are the parameters so the pair is going to be it shift zero so this is exponential apply to close and we are going to be choosing the right color so as i set everything up like this and click on turn and you have your moving moving average so second case we are going to set this set is also our moving average so click on this icon right here then add your moving average so the period is, the period is going to be 15 zero the method is going to be uh you know it so apply to close as well then the color is going to be black so after set everything up like this then click on done and you have your both your um uh, indicator set up in your chart so the next thing that we are going to be adding is going to be in our indicator with the one so we are going to add in our indicator which is going to be in our indicator with the one so sorry so just click on this icon right here so click on this icon right here then we are going to be adding our sorry we are going to be adding our ability strength index which you are seeing right here and your ability to change index this is the parameters so we, are, we don't need this side we don't need it so we are going to set it as our background color so uh, this is it uh, and this is the levels the level is going to be 10 15 18 and 90 levels so after set everything up like this and click on turn now the next indicator which we are going to be adding is also going to be in the indicator window one right here so which is going to be as uh, oscillator which is this right here so I'll just set it as default so link or done and you have your same oscillator as well so now the third indicator we are going to be adding is going to also be in the indicator with one so I go to add it, which is going to be our moving, our moving average. So, add the moving average of the uh, parameters is going to be the, uh, the same as the indicator which is in our main chart. So, the set of up like this: period fifteen, should zero linear width, apply to close. Then the color is going to be black. Then click on done. Then you have your indicator. You have your moving average draw. Indicator with the one. So the last not the least is we are going to be adding our second moving average so click here then 
add your moving average so the pure is going to be eight remember sorry so it's going to be eight so sheet zero method is going to be exponential apply to close and color will be red so click on done we set everything up like this and we see now that we have all our indicator settings so now how are you guys going to be making use of this strategy are you guys going to be making use of this strategy so now uh let me start explaining to it to you guys so now let me first add this up to this 15 minute time frame and you can we are going to be using the there's some label from for this strategy so we are going to be using the both the uh both zoom out and the zoom in so now for your entry you are the zoom level should be like this should be like, let's say you have zoom you have zoom out completely just zoom in twice this one two so we are good we are good to go now so let me add this up so i'm going to be using it and let me add the another one here sorry so let me add another one which is going to be here. So, uh, so now let me first explain the how you guys go make some strategy in your in the chat. So that's what that is, is a quick one. So now, what are we expecting right here? Now, what are we expecting to see? This is five minute time frame. This is five minute time frame strategy. So what are we expecting to see? We're expecting that we are setting because we are what, what are you seeing here? Now you can see the market spike the downside. This is crash for day. Now, what give this market? What this market shows before start packages to the downside. Now the first thing you have to know is that you have to see a chain, a crossover happen right here. Seeing a crossover happen right here. Now let me zoom so you guys can see it a lot more clearly. So you can see a crossover which happens right here. Which happens right here. And here. That is where the, the crossover happens. Now you can see the uh the red line crossing below the black line. And which we are seeing something right here. We also see that the chart the price is also below following the red moving average this indicates that the market will start shooting to the downside now we are seeing something here also in our indicator window one which we are seeing right at the top right here you can see let me zoom so you can see a crossover which happens right here this is where the crossover happens and you can see what the uh awesome later also did now you can see before the crossover happened the moving the two moving average is already at the 90 or 80 levels of the rsi and you can see changing you can see uh you can see also the little changing is volume changing from the green to red this is all the confirmation you need to see before taking any entries okay so now for your tp for you to take your profit based on the division this strategy now we have to see that the uh, this way i'm expecting you guys to lose your trade which you are seeing that there is a crossbar happens right here as well and you can see right here so you can see right here you can see crossovers happens right here as well touching the 15 or 10 levels of the rsi and you can see changing of volume that occurs on the some oscillator so that's when you are going to resist your trees so uh, i say that is for sell trees now for a buy trees now when are you expecting to go for a buy? Now we are expecting to go. For, now let me look for a uh, for a buy. Let me look for a buy setup now. So uh, now let's use this area. Let's use this area as well. So now what are we seeing right here? What are we seeing right here? So we are seeing that you are seeing that the this, we are seeing that the it, it will change over apples right here. This change of our precise if I zoom out, you guys are going to see it a lot more clearly, which is around here. Crossbar happens, and and in our uh, indicator in the one you can see this a crossbar also happens right here at the 15 or 10 levels of the RSI. So, note that guys, now you don't need uh, the awesome is going it doesn't need to be at the uh, 15 or 10 levels. All you have to see in the in the uh in the awesome is that you can see if if it's a sell trade the awesome is going to be down 
is going to be down which means it's going to be below it's going to be down to 15 or 10 levels and it's for a buy you can see it uh, goes up at the 90s or 80 levels so now we're expecting to go for a buy now you can see changing of volume right and also changing and this is where the changing of changing or changes up up of course so you can see this is where the changes of course now we're expecting to take your trade when you see that when this uh this first volume closes it's going to take your trade right here so and you can see the clan account closing following the following the red moving average that's when you are going to take your trade and take your position when the market also almost reaches this area or you close your trade when you see that the crossover happens right here which you can see right here but to be on the server side if you see in the next resistance area you are expecting to close your trades so that's how you guys are going to make use of the strategy this is simple but uh, effective boom and crash strategy you can see i will take my time to explain to you guys how you can make use of the strategy so this strategy is very very effective guys very very effective strategy guys this is just boom and crash strategy i've already backed it and i've already been using the strategy so uh now let me show you guys how you guys are going to make use of the strategy um boom so we are going to be using um 1000 you can see that is where i take trees so uh now you miss this spike you miss this spike right here this will i explained the trade earlier so uh, i think i open this trade right around here when when i see uh when i see this in this when i see this i take the trade you can see it's still spiking you miss that entry board it's okay so now let me show you guys how you guys are going to make some strategy for both the spike and scalping now i will be using this area that i took my trades so now let me first uh add it up so let me add this up then add add this up as well so now <clears throat> what i see right here see now you can see that this is where the this is where uh this is where the market start starting from here you can see this is the, this is where the market changes direction which which the price move above the moving average and also the red move the red moving average closing above the black moving average which indicate that we should go for a what we should go for a buy so now when that's happen we also see something right here a crossover up right in the in our indicator window one and the moving average shortening the 10 levels of 15 levels of the rsi and you can see it, uh, the volume changes right here now i don't expect you guys to open any trades when you see when this happens you are expecting to keep your trade when you see when this happens which means that the uh the the uh the also most later is above the uh 90 or 80 levels of the rsi so this boy said which is going to be a down and for a buy it's going to be up okay so now we're supposed to take to take your entries when you see this area now to be honest, now how are you going to know that this spike is going to be a call we are going to know that the spike is going to be a call when we figure out that the price is almost reaching the support areas which is uh, it is right here that's when i know that market is going to be spiking to the top side now now with that being said so i hope you guys understand how you guys really use strategy for starting spike now for scalping now now for scalping so now i guys can use some strategy to cut to scalp now now we are supposed to use strategy to scalp when this happens we are going to see something right here you can see that the the a crossover happen right in the right here which we are seeing right here a crossover happen, which means that the red line crossing below the back line and also you can see the candle closing below the moving the two moving average following the red line uh now in the keto in the one this also happens which means the moving average touching the 90 or levels of the rsi and also you can see changing of volume we don't expect to take any trees right here as you can see that the, this is spike that occurs so we are not expecting to take any trade right there we are expecting to get a trade when we see that the the uh awesome slater is also going against going against go uh is also going against the price which means that the awesome oscillator is also down which means that it's also down with the you also match with the uh we show it down to the 15 or 
10 levels of the RSI. So this way, when you see that the, uh, this this the red volume that opens, then you take your trace. When this volume closes, you take your trace. Now you're going to take your profit when you see a crossover happens, which happens right here. And you're going to do your street as well, right right here as well. So, or you can use the support area, which is right right here. It is right here. So, uh, that is it, guys. That is it, guys. As you guys are going to make your strategy, the strategy is just effective strategy you can use to be trading your boom and crash and make a massive massive profit so if you are new to my channel don't forget to do me over by subscribe like and turn your post notification get up on your strategy you guys will be aware also guys i want you guys to know that we do something we offer account management we offer account management so you can contact this now the number you are seeing at the screen just contact the number then it's going to be direct you to us straightly so just contact us then we discuss and if you want to join our telecom channel for free signals the link is going to be in the description below so you can join our telecom channel for free signals thank you guys i'll see you in the next video bye